you a very special personality from the world of dogs. He started in dogs in the very early 1970s and uh, his first passion was Lhasa Apsos. So in search of Lhasa Apsos, which in those days in Calcutta, people called it Bhutia, he went all the way to Darjeeling and he found out that at the T Tibetan refugee camp they were breeding Lhasa Apsos. That was part of their culture and a lot of them in the Tibetan Basti in Darjeeling, which is still there, uh, he uh, went there and that started a long chain of Lhasa Apsos coming to Calcutta. And those last apsos were at that time sold in the Hatibagan pet market. The present Galif Street market it is actually shifted from Hatibagan. Uh, it was a century old market in Hatibagan where pets of all kinds used to get sold. And the dog market also flourished there. But the space in that place was too small to accommodate a very uh, uh, prosperous market that kept on uh, growing by leaps and bounds. So the government had to shift it to Galif Street, uh, which is not very far from uh, Hatibagan market, about a kilometer uh, baby. Uh, but Mr. Moloy Roy is a person who has been associated with, with the Hatibagan market uh, before it, uh, from the time uh, in the year 1973. Now I leave it to Mr. Moloroy to tell about him and his journey into the world of Lhasa Apsos and dogs. Uh, well, uh, this is the first time uh, I have started from the Lhasa Apsos because I have very weakness of the Tibetan Apsos. The Tibetan Apsos, the Lhasa Apsos, the same thing because Nobody knows the, what is the Lhasa, why, why, when, the capital of the Tibet is the name of the Lhasa, from there. But then I was the very weakness of the Lhasa Apso. I went to the Darjeeling to find out the Lhasa Apso. Then I uh, spoke with few people in the Darjeeling. They told me that you go to the Tibetan refugee center and the Bhutia Bosti at the year of the 1973. The I went there. From there, I was saying the few Lhasa of Epso. Though I can't say the price. Then when I asked the, what is the price of the puppy, then he was staying the 80 rupees. Only the 80, the Indian money, 80 rupees, 100 rupees, 120 rupees. I became mad. Listen, listen, I became mad the 120 rupees. But I, on that time, I sum the knowledge regarding the Lhasa Apso. What will be the bite? The both testicle found in the scrotum. What is the tail carriage and tail placement? What will be the top line? These are all things. What will be the skull, angulation, the eyes, the stop, everything also. Then I, in the evening, somebody came to me in the hotel and uh, Kang means there is a golden color Lhasa Apso. In their language, they are saying it is a Ratho Rong. What is a Ratho Rong? This is a golden color. And the Thulo Thulo, that is, that is a very stout and that is the age of uh, five to six months. The, I got it. How much this one? He told me that is the, the fixed price, 180 rupees. I took it. And after the day, I came back to Calcutta to take the and I went for the sale in the Hatibagan on the Sunday. The somebody came to me in my area. There is a Mr. Topan Pramanit. Now he is no more. He took it from me and keep it. The well furnished, well keeping, everything also good. He kept me for the handling. I don't know what is the handling on that time. And that time he compete and the exhibit for the dog show. I handle. He got the multiple best in show winner, and the first time uh, he got 
the entitled dream of the top under his highness maharaja jaydeep singh of baria mr stanley dengafield mr nawab nazaria jung at the 6 years of age of the reach i got the second reserve best in the kanpur kennel club under nawab nazaria jam okay at the age of 12 years he is expired and today i am very happy and very pleased to the youtube channel and invited by the mr my close friend mr parthas sagar chair is an international judge and uh, i handled uh, at the manila philippines i think so 2001 or 2002 taking the golden retriever mel i got the best of breed and cc under mr parthasika chatterjee i handle i have, yeah, yeah. I, have the, i have handled the 24 kinds of breeds i don't know but i can say uh, who has done it who has handled in this uh, kolkata the 24 kinds of breeds i have handled and uh, um, i got the multiple best in show winner mr parthasika chatterjee breeding the doberman i got the reserve best uh, puppy in the show under wg pill state from australia and i got the manila when i under uh, mr parthas agar chatterjee i handled the golden retriever he was turned i got the best of breed and cc oh, that is all my passion i was the very very kinds of handling in the 1991 i was invited in the malaysia under larry win mr gil sharman from australia and uh, 16 times i was the best handler in the 1995 from brecken for south africa mr andre from andre mo come from south africa and he told one of the boxer puppy the my breeding that the female is me and the father is a australia imported champion katia diamond trader i took that service the one male puppy i got it i hand over to my friend he got the best puppy in the show the many many good breeds the german shepherd boxers everything also and he person was that yesterday from yesterday i am seeing the handling of this gentleman this gentleman he can compete with any handlers any types of breed any high place all over the world i have started my career the 1973 in dog game uh I want to say that uh, I am very happy and very pleased. Uh, the pets and animal, the YouTube channel, and invited my friend Mr. Patu Sekar Chaudhary is the international judge, and uh, I am very uh, happy to say that uh, I am very, 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 very happy. And thanks a lot to everybody, and uh, everybody can uh, response of my handling. everybody has response of my handling and i want to say that you can believe and trust on me regarding the all breeds 